here and I am not happy with the tire that was given to me with this bike. It's bite is very good with the stock uh, brake pads that I'm getting but I think it could be still better because I'm not getting that confidence whenever you know I try to I want to do triple digit speed what's happening YouTube I'm back again uh, <laughs> it's Friday today and I'm just done with my work the R has to roll and matter I thought why don't I just go ahead and you know just head out go for a short spin and then come back it was a pretty instantaneous decision I don't have enough charge on my GoPro and also on my phone so and you know what it's actually drizzling and this is it's almost five to six and it's drizzling and this is how the weather is <laughs> believe me we are still in summer for a time to be alive I thought why don't I just casually head out and then have a small chat with you guys I want to know how was the earlier vlog where I was showing uh, my work process uh, you know with regards to photography so I mean not the whole work process but then again it's more like you know how I shoot someone if I were to do a small shoot I thought it was drizzling but then oh my god looks like it's gonna pour a bit and you know I actually had to put this GoPro in some uh, the other external third party case and then that's how I got it mounted onto my helmet so now technically I don't know if this is a waterproof GoPro or if this is a regular GoPro now because uh, I had to remove the battery cover and then of course this case covers the battery part pretty well still <laughs> not sure but I really hope that the battery backup mera saath de kyunki I don't know as you all know the uh, it's I believe I can nice move um, anyway, battery backup on the GoPro is pathetic. I hope this uh, lasts until I want to vlog. I have to just turn it off and on each time just to save the battery. But yeah, let's just see how it's gonna be. It is drizzling. I mean, it's more than drizzling, you know. And I didn't wear any jacket. Uh, have to see. I think uh, this is pretty good habit at least which, what I really think you know just going out after you are done with your work just heading out for some time having time for yourself because it's important right okay I think I have to stop somewhere oh boy I just cleaned the bike because even yesterday it was it was pouring actually and uh, the bike was you know it was covered in the whole muck uh, and i was pretty lazy to just just wash it off on then and there but then since i plan to head it out i just wash this bike and this is what the nature has planned Abhe, nice see are you able to see i don't know if gopro is capturing it though but Oh boy. I'm at Madhapur and I don't know where I'm going but I have no plan but let's just see. It's actually pouring now. Wow. I think I have to stop somewhere bro. Okay. Bro. What do I do? <laughs> do I really have to stop somewhere? I really don't want to stop, but okay. <laughs> I just want to see if you know if we can go a little further and if it's not so much drizzling the way it is happening here. <sighs> but also, I don't want to take a chance. I mean, come on! Wow, very nice. Such an amazing driver, you. It's better I stop somewhere.
I shouldn't have come out today, but then it's okay. Me being me, if I decide that I have to come out, then I have to come out. Abey sale. Let's hope there's not much rain in this part. What क्या फर्क पड़ता है? The moment I just pick up the speed, you know, the rain hits me even harder. So, what else? What's happening? <laughs> And you, you know what, guys? I know this is probably the most not so related uh, observation, but then since the return to office policy has been executed. the hyderabad roads are filled with vehicles you know it's it's filled with traffic traffic jams <laughs> and it's just it just takes a obnoxiously long time to reach from point a to point b now <laughs> even though the traffic is better right now but yeah and i don't know why this guy had to stop and maybe i'll actually see you guys once it stops drizzling a few hours later hmm okay the rain uh, i mean it's tad bit better i mean it is still drizzling but uh, okay no props oh boy As you guys know, it started raining and then I had to put the GoPro down. I was waiting somewhere, and uske baad, while I was waiting, one of my friend called, and she was like, "Let's meet up." <laughs> I told I'm stuck in rain literally, and uh, she was like, "I mean, it's okay. Let's just catch up at uh, Hard Cup Kondapur." So I was like, "Okay, why not?" The problem with the rain in Hyderabad is, after rain, this is how the traffic is. I think it's the same thing most of the cities in India. I hope it just stays the way it is, or it, or if it doesn't drizzle at all, that would be even better. But then you know what? Jokes on me. I cleaned this bike very good, chaka chak, ek dum, and <laughs> after uh, like five minutes or ten minutes, when I came out. started pouring i mean it started drizzling and then started to pour so okay this bike is all kachra kachra <laughs> this is one problem yaar When we park our bikes in the cafe, it doesn't have proper parking. This is the issue. But yeah, even I was given an intimation that even I have to return back to office from fifth of June. And I'm not so happy about it. The moment you wanna work just from the home itself, all of your benefits would get cut. So I'd rather start working from the office itself. At least that's how I'd be able to afford all of this. Or <laughs> the petrol for this vehicle, at least. Ibe, tap gins kunte manchidi. As I was talking about the bikes and driving bikes in the wet conditions, I'd prefer driving the vehicle in the dry conditions because, again, you would have tons of grip. that again depends upon the tire and i am not happy with the tire that was given to me with this bike it's a seat tire earlier we used to get pirelli tires but then after covid we have to be happy just with the seat tires which we get from the factory i'm looking forward to change them i thought i could actually change it off as soon as possible but then There's pretty good life, which is still left on the tires, and what it's hardly not even 1,500 kilometers driven. I mean, yeah, अभी तो 1473 हुआ है. हाँ, so 
Yeah, looking forward to change the tires and also the bite is very good with the stock uh, brake pads that I'm getting. But I think it could be still better because I'm not getting that confidence whenever you know I try to I want to do triple digit speed. It doesn't really give me that confidence because it feels very spongy. So that's one thing that I have to change. And also I got my headlight. Uh, replaced i mean i changed it from the halogen to an led um few people were not happy with it because they told uh, it really takes the essence of the bike because it's a classic bike and then you need to have that halogen lamp for the look but then for me more than the look i need the drivability capabilities and how good the light is also decides where i go so i prefer having this light than the factory light for factory given light so even if i turn i want a corner on this bike right the problem with the c8 tires that is the tires which are given with this bike with the factory uh, tires is that i felt these tires actually kind of slip and let me tell you i do have prior experience on how to corner the vehicles this is coming from an experienced guy and yeah i'm pretty i'm not so happy with these tires so i think i have to switch i have to the sound which this bike produces when the barrels get heated up is amazing man so yeah i also believe that i'm sort of improving with respect to vlogging uh earlier i never used to have that confidence of you know talking to myself when there's a camera attached uh to my helmet it's all first time i just want to try something out something new because earlier it was more like you know i really don't know how it's going to turn out uh would it be good enough i don't know i really don't have the experience of vlogging would i be doing justice but then later on i realized it is not about doing justice but letting the people know that what exactly you are i mean who exactly you are I think the petrol bunk should be close by. Why does he want to race with me, bro? <laughs> Why is there a big line? A few hours later. चलो अपना टर्न भी आ गया फुल टैंक कार्ड फुल टैंक थाउजेंड नाइन्टी थ्री हाउ टू गेट रॉयली स्क्रू आई थिंक आई लेंड दिस ब्लॉग राइट हियर गाइस एंड thank you so much for watching it till the end and uh, if you really like my content don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel because that would also gives me motivation to make more such videos and way more better videos than this